What's going on everybody? What's going on YouTube? Um, coming to you guys on an early Saturday morning. Just stopped raining sometime yesterday. Supposed to get some more rain in today. Birds are chirping. But today I want to talk to you guys about grub control. Specifically about a product that I was I had a lot of faith in I thought that actually worked until I read a study that was done out of a Michigan uh, state at the extension office. I got a lot of uh, the grass trying to kill this stuff off. But uh, let's talk about this product. Let's walk into my garage and so look at and look at this particular product. A lot of you probably got this product and actually thought it's working. But after I read this study, and I will put a link in the bio for this product. And why it doesn't work. And I am going to contact the company and see if maybe I, if I can get some uh, clarification. Here's the product, Specticide Insect Killer for Lawn and Landscape. You know what guys, I really thought I was doing a good job on my lawn spraying for the grubs and I noticed that some of my some of my some of my patches in my backyard some of my grass in my backyard I'm sorry still have brown patches and I pulled some back and I saw some grubs so first thing I did was went back out and got this particular product. Well as most lawn care people do they try to find the you know the latest and nearest research and I found out this particular product would not kill grub worms at any rate and again i'm gonna put the link in the bio so if you have this product i advise you to probably stop using it do a little bit more research maybe go buy a sky spraying bear advance uh, brand but definitely stop buying this brand until you do a little bit more research and i was shocked to be honest with you because you know this product is everywhere and um to be honest with you, I thought that, you know, I was doing the right thing by buying this product and hopefully killing grub worms, you know, from the germ from my uh, from laying eggs, from you know, from pre preventing them that's already in my lawn. And uh, after I read that study, I was left in shock that this particular product, this product right here, does not kill grub worms, particularly grub worms, uh, chick bugs, or any of the uh saw worms to be exact um, or mole crickets it, it, it doesn't kill any of those things because it's a watered down product it's advertised the way it's supposed to it's supposed to kill, and kill these particular insects and does not do any of those things and as you know there are a lot of products uh, on the market that say they do a lot of different things and don't in this particular product I'm not going to lie I was shocked as you can see, it's fast acting, fast acting formula. Kills all these particular bugs. And you hook it up to your hose and you think you're doing something. And it doesn't matter if you get the liquid kind or the grainy kind. From the research that I read, it does not do anything. It's a waste of money, people. Waste of money. So I took some shots of the uh, particular um, article and I'm gonna put it on my Instagram page, Ken Long Care on a Budget, uh, on Instagram, so you can read that if you don't feel like going to the particular link in the uh, in the YouTube page. So, uh, you know, if you got this particular product, you know, I think you need to stop using it until you read the research, and uh, maybe stay tuned and see if I can get an answer out of these particular people. To see if if uh, you know if this if, if that article is correct and can they challenge that article or give us some uh, clarification on if this particular product work or not because it's to be honest with you it's uh from what I read it's a waste of money. With that being said, guys, listen. There's also a product on the market that you can use if you got mosquitoes and it's it's, it's that time.
I hadn't put it out yet because it's been raining like crazy. So I'm advising everybody to go out and get this product. And I know it got a whole lot of different things. It said kills, you know, a whole lot of different things. Cover 5,000 square feet of your lawn. You again got the thing you can hook up. The spray comes out. Hook your note. Hook your water hose up to it. Got a good a level right there. Probably made by the same people. Um, I think Allen and Lawn Care Nut did a product review on this as well. So check out his page, Lawn Care Nut, if you have it. Um, this particular product, you can use this product on your shrubs. Right here. And um, you can use it on your lawn. And I want this product because of one thing. It kills mosquitoes. And I know it kills a whole bunch of other things, fleas and stuff like that. You can get it for that particular reason too. But you... The main course for this particular product is mosquitoes. So if you have mosquitoes in your area, please go out and buy this particular product. Uh, it would definitely help cut down some of the mosquitoes in your area. Now there's a whole lot of other prevention things you gotta do as well. Hold on for a second. Sorry about that. There's a whole lot of other things you need to do as well. You definitely need to declutter the area. Um, um, get rid of the standing water to get rid of mosquitoes as well but this particular product will help you get rid of some get rid of those mosquitoes as well so don't just rely on this product alone there's some things some homework you got to do in order to get rid of that uh, some mosquitoes won't hibernate in those areas and again you can use this on shrubs if you're in florida you can use it on your palm you can use it pretty much on anything you can spray your trees um places that mosquitoes like to, this to particularly this bush right here that I am going to zoom in on it. See can I zoom in on it. It's been raining that thing just grew like crazy. So yeah buddy you gonna you coming down. Turn it down. As soon as it starts raining it's you and I anyway this particular product you definitely want to go out there and grab some uh, the cutter backyard bug control spray. So get, get this product if you got mosquitoes and things of that nature, uh, particularly in your area. I'm going to use it to control my front yard. My wife and I spend a lot of time in our front yard. Definitely spray a little bit more of you in the area that uh, you, spend, you and your family spend a lot more time. So definitely go out and get this product. And stay tuned to some other videos. I got a, I got about five videos I need to get out between work and play. It's just I love this. Again, not an expert. This is my yard is my play my play time. My wife knows it. Um, so go out and get this particular product. And um, if you got that uh, other product, get rid of it, please, because I am going to do it today. And go get a Scotch brand and uh, or a Bear Advance brand. And uh, you know, just stay tuned and see if I get a good answer from uh, from the, from the people. Hey, and if you're out there and you don't know if you got grubs, a good way to check it is to, you know, get a shovel or something and you try to pull back some of your lawn, see if there's grub worms. Maybe you use this product and you still want to know if you got it. Just do that. Or if you got a lot of birds that enter your land, I mean, I'm sorry, your land. Sorry, not your land, your yard. And um, if you start seeing birds and stuff like that, uh, another pro another way, you know, you got, like me, I got grub, uh, I got uh, moles trying to get rid of those suckers. Uh, that's another uh, way of knowing you got grub worms or skunks, possums, things of that nature. That's another way of knowing you got grub worms. But the best thing to do is to get a flat shovel, you know, try to pull back some of that layer of grass and see if you got grubs. And uh, get this product today if you see that uh, the Bear Vans or the Scotch brand. Do not buy the, the other brand. So uh, check and see if you got it. Let me know. If y'all have it, if you have any comments, anything like that, if you had success with the product, let me know as well. Give this video a thumbs up. Follow my Instagram page, Ken Long Care on the Budget. I post a lot of things there. Um, so let me know what y'all think. I just want to throw that out there to you, and maybe let's start a discussion about it. Maybe these we can get the uh, the maker of that particular product. You know, to maybe join me on a on a call one day to see if we can uh, get some answers for you. And again, I will put a link in the bio of where you can read that at. Uh, again, that study out of Michigan State. And also, uh, if you want to go on Instagram, I have some clippings of that particular article on my Instagram page later today. All right, guys. It's early. 
Uh, rain's about to get ready to come in. I'm getting ready to head to Home Depot and return my uh, products and get a more uh, better brand. All right, guys. I'll see y'all next time in the next video. Peace.